Well, we did it. We made it through term two. One that over time I hope I can process uh, with specific clarity on what we have collectively actually accomplished. Thinking back to the end of last year, I thought that the new phone policy was going to be the biggest issue we were going to face. Wow, how wrong was I? So how do I assess the success of the college across semester one? What criteria have I used? And like all assessments, what evidence do I have? Well, I've chosen three categories for reflection and assessment. The first one is our students. The amazing adaptability and flexibility to change and to thrive. All the research continues to reinforce the plasticity of the child's brain to adapt and overcome to their environments. That they have, well, they have certainly done that. The feedback that we have received from students and parents has strongly indicated that most students accepted the challenges of remote learning and continued on with their studies and learning. I'm extremely proud of every student in the college and know that we all faced our own personal challenges differently and succeeded in a diversity of ways uh, uh, for most, in most circumstances. Staff, I've said this many times, but it is my absolute honour to work with such a dedicated and committed staff uh, at Hazel Glen College. Everything they do is putting students at the forefront. Their work ethic and drive to just do what is needed for the students they teach and care for is second to none. Staff continue to provide unbelievable support to each other during remote learning during difficult times. The college leadership consistently support, care and guide to each other staff members during this time was incredible. This certainly makes it an amazing place to work and to learn for students and staff. Our parents, I hope you've enjoyed the video of our students saying thank you to all mums and dads. I've spoken to many parents and they have shared their stories of home learning and challenges to work, care and educate their children at home all at the same time. This is why you deserve and get the Hazel Glen Hero Award to our, for all our respect and appreciation for everything that you have done to support your family over the past 14 weeks. Your feedback and consistent words of encouragement to me personally and to the staff have been very well received. I would, I would like to thank personally Anthea Jamison for her leadership and guidance as college deputy over the last six months while I was jumping between both Hazelland College and Mernda Central. Her work ethic and dedication to run the college in my absence has been absolutely amazing. My time at Mernda Central concludes at the end of the school holidays and I know uh, they will be in very capable hands moving forward. What is our loss is Mernda Central's gain with Anthony Oldmeadow being appointed the new principal. He is with me today and would like to say a few words um, as he exits the school. Thank you, Anthony. Thank you, Anthony. It has been an absolute honour for me to work at Hazel Glen College over the past six years since commencement in 2014. Witnessing firsthand the growth and development of this amazing educational precinct and community has been a proud journey for me professionally and personally. I would like to thank the amazingly dedicated staff at Hazel Glen College who forever amaze me in their care and compassion for the students at this college. They constantly go above and beyond and I cannot thank them enough for their ongoing support throughout my time at the college. I would also like to thank Anthony Stockwell for his inspiring leadership. He has set up an amazing college and culture within Doreen and certainly is to be admired for his commitment to this and the wider Mernda community over the last six months. Hazel Glen College will continue to thrive under his leadership and I look forward to personally working closely with Anthony in my new role at Mernda Central. Finally, I would like to thank the community that I hold so dearly in my heart as a member of both Lorimer and Hazel Glen schools. You are an amazing group of caring and supportive people building such a strong foundation for our students within this community. I'm only just heading over the road and looking forward to the opportunity to build strength in our area and hopefully an unmatched northern suburb community for us to work, live and play. Thanks again. 
I look forward to seeing you all soon. Enjoy your break, everyone. Thank you.